My name is Nilanjana Datta. I am a student of IB Professional School. As a part of my research project, I have done a project on video game sales analyzing it using SQL. First, let's have an overview of my project. Video game industry is widely developing and spreading in recent years. Video games are defined based on their platform, which include arcade video games, console games, personal computer games. In recent times, even mobile gaming has also developed. The problem statement to my project is, from the point of view of an investor or a gaming company, we want to know the popular genres and platforms which have more sales over the years so that we can invest or publish more games on those genre and platforms. Next is an overview of my data set. So here is my data set of video game sales which I have collected from Kaggle. There are 10 columns in my data set which contain name of the games, the platform or console in which the game is being released, the year of release, the genres and publishers of the games along with it we have North American sales, Europe sales, Japan sales, other sales and the total global sales. This data set contains 10 column and 16720 rows. So next let's go to my SQL workbench. This is my workbench and I'm connecting with my local server. Here I have written some queries. So let's first use the data set database that have created research project. Now in SQL, we can store data in our database. It helps to manipulating data very easily and answer our questions. So first, to do so, we have to import our table. The data set that we have on game sales, I have already imported it. Tables can be imported in two ways in SQL. Uh, first, by just right clicking on the tables and going to table data import wizard and then browsing our file in our device and then importing it and the next method which i have used is importing it to command line prompt first i have created a table with its name and the data types and these data types should match with the data set that we are going to import in our workbench then i have run some command line to get my data inside to get the data imported in MySQL. Next, I would first uh, I would like to see that is my data being imported or not. So here we can see that yes, the data are being perfectly imported. Now let's start answering the questions. First, I want to know the top 5 genres that have maximum sales over the years. So what I have used over here is a sum function to get the global sales sum and round it to two decimal places and then I have grouped it by genres ordered by total sales in descending because we need the maximum sales and then limited by 5 to get top 5. So let's run this query. Okay, the top five genres are action, sports, shooter, role playing platforms. So the top here, we have a chart depicting our output. The top five genres that have maximum sales over the years are action, sports, 
shooter, role playing, and platform. Action games are the most popular ones. The gamers are more inclined towards the action and sports genres. Now we need to know the next question, which is top five platforms that have maximum sales over the years. I have used the same approach over here. I have changed only the grouping part. I have grouped this data by my platforms or consoles. Let's run this query. So we have top five platforms which gives maximum sales over the years. Now this graph shows my output data. The top five popular consoles are PS2, X360, PS3, Y2, sorry, W2 and DS which means most gamers has those consoles. So the gaming company if it wants to produce a game it should be on those platforms to get more sales. PS2 is the most demanding one. Next question. So now we want to know the number of games released for given genres to know the trend. So here is my output. And the analysis shows that over the years there has been 3370 games released on action genres, 2348 games on sports, 1500 games on role play. On an overall, we can say that the gaming industry is more promising on the games based on action, sports, role playing genres. Next, let's come to the, our next question, which is which platform had maximum games released on it? So if we want to release a game, we need to know that which platform has more released games in it so that it could be a better idea to know the market. So here I have used two approaches. First, I have counted the records and then grouped it by platform and ordered by the countings. Next, what we can do is that we can use Windows function. I have used dense rank over here to get a ranking along with it. So let's run this query. So here we can see that these are the platforms where this number of games is being released and the ranking like the top most popular platform where most games are released are PS2. So it's ranked one. Now we want only the top 10. So what I have done, I have selected the inner query as a temporary table platform rank. And then I have selected a platform and number of game columns from this temporary table. And then I have mentioned my condition that where ranking is less than 10 so that we can get our answers for top 10 platforms which are where most of the games are being released so if we can see the ranking it should be till gba so let's run the query here only till ps2 to gba the output has come now let's analyze it so from the chart, what we can tell that PS2 had the most number of games released in this console. Next, it's DS. This dual screening gives almost equal competition. And then it's PlayStation 3, W2 or are among the other popular consoles. Next, let's run the next query, which is for the top 10 publishers whose sales are highest as per region. So this is my output. 
let's analyze it so here it shows all the four regions north america sales europe sales japan sales and other sales over the years north america sales has always been the maximum top publishers or gaming companies are nintendo electronic arts activation sony regions like north america europe are the most flourishing businesses compared to the japan because we can see that japan has always been an abrupt increase decreasing sales next we want to know that which gaming platform had the maximum sales on which genre so here i have carry out the queries in different on different columns we can do it together as well so let's run the query so it's w2 plat w2 on platform on genre sports has maximum sales on north america now next let's run it for the europe sales it shows the same results that w2 and the sports genre had the maximum sales for japan it is same okay, so the analysis shows that the maximum selling game if we compare all the region wise sales over the years we observe that maximum sales are always made on w2 platform on sports genres now with this we come to the conclusion answering the problem statement the gaming company should release more games on action sports role play and shooter genres it should focus on consoles like ps2 x360 ps3 w2 and ds a company should release its game on north america and europe region first because sales on those regions are high and expand worldwide for better sales an investor can invest in companies like nintendo electronic arts activision sony for better profits a gaming company should have detailed knowledge on the leading publishers in the industry before releasing a game so it should study the sales of these publishers thank you